Romain Wattel finally tasted victory on the European tour at the 187th time of asking as the Frenchman held off the challenge of Kiradech Afferbarnrat at the KLM Open, as Paul Duncar did a terrific closing 66 to finish 14th. Wattel, who had not recorded a top-20 finish all season prior to ending his title drought at the Dutch, was level with Thailand's Afabarn Rat for much of the back nine but saw his challenger find water twice in the last four holes, with both leading to double bogeys. That meant a par at the last was enough for the 26-year-old to secure victory with a 15-under total following a closing round of 69. Fellow Frenchman at Matpave and waited by the 18th green to give his countryman and friend a truly French celebration bottle with popping cork pick. Twitter.com The European Tour at European Tour September 17, 2017. Wattle won by one from fast finishing Canadian Aston Connolly, who shot six birdies en route to signing for a 66, with former world number one Lee Westwood part of a six way tie for third at 13 under. Dunn ended his tournament on 11 under, just four off the winner, while Paul Harrington finished on three under after signing off with a 69. I came to this tournament, I was playing poorly to be honest, Wattle told Sky Sports Golf. Last week I struggled with my game. I'm happy with the way I played all week. It's been a very nice weekend. I've been putting really bad the last two years I think him a really good putter but the last two years were tough for me. It was a very nice weekend memo https.koji40x2fpig.twitter.com 1hk 29u6nxk The European Tour at European Tour September 17, 2017 I never thought about the score, I just tried to play my best. I was just trying to be as high as I could on the leaderboard but it was very tight. I just tried to play my own game. Wattle had recorded 25 top 10 finishes in his previous 186 events without tasting victory, and surpassed overnight leader Affa Barnrat with three birdies in his first six holes. A dropped shot on the 8th was recovered on the 10th and, although Wattle bogeyed the next, he remained in the hunt by parrying his way in as others fell away. Affa Barnrat briefly led when he birdied the 14th but he found water at the next and double bogeyed before suffering the same fate at the last as he attempted to put pressure on Wattle by reaching the green at the par 5 in 2. Westwood never threatened to end his three-year European Tour title drought during the final round, although he did birdie the last to sign for a 69 and finish alongside compatriot Eddie Pepperell, Francis Joel Stalter, German Sebastian Heisel and South Africans George Coutsey and Justin Walters.